all right you're welcome back in this video we're going to talk about unit vectors okay unit vectors a unit vector is a vector that has a magnitude of one the length of a unit vector is one so take note of that now i have a vector v v a unit vector in the direction of this vector is given as v with a caret at the top equal to the vector itself all over the modulus of the vector so this is the formula for unit vector that is in the same direction or that is parallel to another vector v what if this unit vector is in the opposite direction of this vector v the unit vector in the opposite direction is given as minus v all over the absolute value of v so this one is when the unit vector is in the same direction or is parallel to this particular vector and this is when this unit vector is in the opposite direction of this what vector sometimes you can write this notation as unit vector some can say u equal to v all over absolute value of v or they can put a caret at the top whichever one we are still talking about unit vector sometimes for this we can see the unit vector in the opposite direction you get it so these are the notations for unit vectors all right let's go ahead and solve some problems if a is equal to 3i minus j minus 4k b equal to minus 2i plus 4j minus 3k and c is equal to i plus 2j minus k we are to find the unit vector parallel to the vector 3a minus 2b plus 4c in other words we are looking for a unit vector that is in the same direction of this vector let's call this vector v v equal to 3a minus 2b plus 4c let's evaluate 3a minus 2b plus 4c what's 3a 3a is equal to this use 3 to multiply everything here 9i minus 3j minus 12k what will be 2b use 2 to multiply everything we have minus 4i plus 8j minus 6k and 4c use 4 to multiply through 4i plus 8j minus 4k so what will be the vector now 3a minus 2b plus 4c 3a minus 2b plus 4c will now be equal to this this is 3a then minus what's 2b this is 2b minus 4i plus 8j minus 6k what's 4c this is 4c 4i plus 8j minus 4k so we have 9i minus 3j minus 12k the minus we enter the brackets and we have plus 4i minus 8j okay then plus 6k plus 4i plus 8j minus 4k 9 plus 4 is 13 13 plus 4 is 17 so we have 17i minus 3 minus 8 okay minus 8 minus minus 8 plus 8 is 0 so we have just minus 3j left minus 3j and lastly um 6 minus 4 that's 2 2 minus 12 minus 10 so we have minus 12k minus 10k rather minus 10k so this is the vector v this is what v is equal to so remember for unit vector that is in the same direction as a given vector v we said that the unit vector formula is the vector itself all over what the modulus of the vector 
So this is it. Let's determine the modulus of this particular vector now. The modulus of V is the square root, remember, of 17 squared plus minus 3 squared plus minus 10 squared. Okay, what is 17 squared? 17 squared. 289. Okay, let's come here. 289. Minus 3 squared is 9. Uh, minus 10 squared is 100. 289 plus 9 plus 100 is 398. So we have 398. Okay, we can just decide to leave it like this since 398 is not a perfect square. So this is the modulus of this particular vector. So what will be the unit vector now? The unit vector, let me write this at the top, is this. V, the unit vector is the vector itself, 17i minus 3j minus 10k divided by the modulus, which is this, root 398, which we can write as 17i over root 398 minus 3j over the same root 398 minus 10k all over what? Root 398. This is the unit vector in the same direction or that is parallel to this um, vector. So this is it. Let us find the unit vector in the opposite direction of this given vector. Alright? So we are going to make use of that formula. In this case now, the unit vector will now be minus V all over the absolute value of V. So first of all, what is the modulus of this vector? The absolute value is minus 2 squared plus 3 squared plus minus 6 squared. Okay, so V, the absolute value is, this is 4, 9, 36. 4, 9, 36. Okay. 36 plus 4 is 40. 40 plus 9 is 49. The square root of 49 is 7. So the modulus of the vector is 7. So therefore, the unit vector in the opposite direction is equal to this minus what's vector v? This is vector v. Minus 2i plus 3j minus 6k. And what's the modulus? 7. So I can enclose it like this to show that this minus is affecting each component in that vector. Okay, so the vector the unit vector is equal to minus i want to split it now minus 2i over 7 plus 3j over 7 minus 6k over 7. so this is the unit vector that is in the opposite direction as this vector this is it for unit vectors remember to subscribe to this channel like and share this video to your friends and to your classmates as well I'll see you in the next one. Keep following.